survivors of the Manchester Arena attack are taking part in the run. Georgina Little John 57 minutes Sunday May 20, 2018 A minute's silence has taken place before the Great Manchester run in memory of those killed in the city's terror attack last year. The annual race, which features a 10K event and a half marathon, is happening almost a year to the day that 22 people attending an Ariana Grande concert at the Manchester Arena were killed by suicide bomber Salman Abedi. Some of the survivors are participating in the race including Martin Hibbert who was left paralyzed after the attack. Mr. Hibbert is racing the 10K in a wheelchair while raising funds for the three hospitals that treated him and his daughter Eve. Remembering the victims he hopes to raise a total of £1 million by competing in various races during the next 12 months, including the Boston Marathon. All I'm thinking about is finishing the 10K with all my family and my friends and the whole of Manchester cheering me on and that's what's going to get me round, he said. I didn't think about how tough it would be, if I could even do it. Freya Lewis, 15, who was seriously injured in the attack and had to undergo 60 hours of surgery and learn how to walk again, is also taking part. Raising money Freya, whose friend Nell Jones was killed in the attack, started the junior event and, like Mr. Hibbert, is also raising money for the hospital that treated her. Sir Mo Farah and Ethiopian champion Tiranesh Dibaba are taking part alongside 30,000 competitors, making it the third largest running event in the UK after the London Marathon and the Great North Run. Speaking before the minute silence, Luth Aramon, from Manchester City Council, said, It will have real resonance after last year's event epitomised Manchester's spirit of togetherness following the heinous attack on our city. Read more, Manchester Arena Bombing, National Minute of Silence to be held to remember victims, I survived the Manchester Arena attack. The shrapnel marks are the first thing I see when I look in the mirror, Manchester Arena Bombing, 800 people left with physical and deep psychological injuries, Kurz Lake Report, How Manchester Arena Attack Victims and Their Families Feel Now iNews HTTPS colon slash slash iNews.co.uk